Why do you have to be weird? What is up, you sexy beasts? Hey, if it's your first time here, my name is Vakey. I am a photographer, videographer in the fitness CrossFit space, and I have a go here on YouTube as well. So uh, if you like the content, I'd really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button. I haven't made any videos for the channel in over two weeks because we've moved house and I got behind on client work. But last night I made like a two minute video and that got the fire burning again, got me really excited again. So we're back into it. And today I want to show you my new house, but more importantly, I want to show you the backyard where I'm going to be building a gym, a gym that will be greater than James Newbury. James Newbury, James, hey James, what's up James? A home gym that will make James Newbury's gym looks like a pile of garbage, you know? That's the goal anyway. Ah, it's gonna be hard, this gym's so nice. So yeah, I thought I'd give you a quick tour of the house for those who are interested, and then we'll go outside. It is raining today, of all days that I get back into vlogging, it's raining on the Gold Coast where it never rains. Um, but go and show you where the gym's gonna go. And I saw that James just picked up a rope yesterday and did like 500 double unders unbroken, just cold. So uh, I might pick up my rope and see what I can do on broken cold. Um, I would be very happy if I can get to 200, but uh, I haven't done a dubby in a while. So let me quickly show you the house. I actually just remembered that I took some footage last week when we were just moving in and I uh, did some time lapses of setting up the office and some of the stuff arriving. So I might cut to that footage now and then I'll show you the office. Hi. <laughs> Come out. And right now, I'm actually waiting for a truck from IKEA with my stand -up, my new stand-up desk, a little sofa couch for the office if we get visitors. So yeah, just waiting for uh, waiting for the truck. You haven't been on here for a while. Hey buddy. Hey buddy. Misty. Hey Misty Moo. Ah. Right so we had our first night at the new house last night and uh, still got a fair bit to sort, sort out. Uh, you just gather stuff. I thought we had nothing but obviously we do have some stuff. I'm super excited for this new house because not only is the office a lot better, I'm going to have three really cool backdrops for my videos. I'm going to set up a home gym, an outdoor home gym, um, so the content is going to go through the roof. And I'm going to have a jungle gym. You are, you are going to have a jungle gym. And a cubby house. And a cubby house. All the things. <laughs> this might be it right here. There she is. Bring it in, buddy. Hey, hey mate. How are you? Good, how are you? Chucks it! Yeah. Wow. Take this down. I'll we'll just come back. follow you everywhere. As well as, uh, as well as no videos the last couple of weeks, there's also been no training. This should be the last of assembling flatbacks. So I'm going to drag all this into my office because we have a sofa bed, couch, uh, we have a stand-up desk. So uh, let me go show you my room. The natural light in this house is awesome, there's just windows everywhere so again, always thinking about the video, you know? Okay, so it's not a massive space but let me, uh, let me sell you on the vision. So, Got brand new carpet put in, painted these two walls black. Okay, so here's the idea. Stand up desk that I'm gonna build, it's gonna go against this wall. So that'll be one kind of, one way of filming. The sofa bed's going up against this wall. So again, there's be another kind of set with the sofa there. And then finally, I took the doors off the wardrobe and put some of these beautiful, rugged looking, very rustic shelves in. So yeah, so this will be another backdrop. What I've done is I've ordered these 
these legs from IKEA, these wheel legs, so they all go on the, the white desk, so that way I can wheel the white desk any way I want it. So I'm gonna probably wheel that in front of the wardrobe, and that'll be another set. So, not a massive space, but I think once it's set up, having three different backdrops to film against is gonna be epic. So uh, right now, I'm gonna probably flat back for the next two hours. So I'll time lapse a bit of that, and I'll show you the finished product. Oh, hi there. Desk is all done. It's high, you can go high. Pumped on it, pumped on it, have a look. Look at that, what a beauty. What a beauty. So there we go, stand up desk done. Now I've got to build the sofa bed. So take me on a trip, 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 nah, trip, trip, trip. Oh, I flick the switch, kill the lights. That was a mission. It took so long to set up the desk and the couch and both these pieces are a lot bigger than I initially thought so the plan I described for this room didn't quite come to fruition but uh, I'm still really happy with the way it turned out so let me show you around. This is my new IKEA desk, stand up desk. So there it is, it's a beast and uh, it's nice and big so it fits my brand new, I think it's a 32 inch curved Samsung screen. Look at that thing. And so, uh, yeah, this is where I base myself, this is where I work. Got a sofa couch, so if you want to come and stay, that pulls out into a double bed, so uh, I can host you. And that's about it. It's a pretty tiny office, but what I love about it is I've got a few different kind of ways I can shoot. So I can shoot this way um, while I'm working on the computer with, um, let me turn these lights on. So I can shoot that way while I'm working on the computer with that backdrop. I took the doors off the wardrobe, put some shelves in, put some lights in, so I can shoot that way. Then I can shoot towards the couch, like the way I did at the start of this video. Kind of shoot with that nice little back, black backdrop. And then I'm thinking another cool set would be shooting against this wall using this little pod seat. And that's it, super simple office, but I love it. And it's, uh, it's an inspiring environment. I definitely love hanging out in here and working. Okay, let me quickly show you the rest of the house. I might show you the front of the house later because it's pouring down with rain, but uh, some nice palm trees at the front of the house. I love our front door, big heavy wooden front door. We've got the formal lounge if you want to be an adult and have some uh, deep conversations. We've got the dining area where the cat shouldn't be. Yeah, get off. Look at this cat, how beautiful is she? Eh, hey. misty moo. We've got the, uh, the most important room in the house, the kitchen. We're actually getting this kitchen, uh, getting the kitchen redone. Nice white cabinetry, marble bench, so it's getting done in the next kind of three weeks. Family lounge, Netflix, Apple TV, good times, you know? Still gotta hang this bad boy up. Got the laundry, cat's toilet, guest toilet. I got my wife a little Dyson blade as a, uh, a gift for the house. It's been a game changer actually. Bathroom, shower, bath, all the goods. This is uh, my new bedroom. My wife will kill me if I walk into the master bedroom and it's not tidy. Yes, she's tidy. Good size, good size bedroom. I don't en suite. Boom. Sup. 
And then the master bedroom actually opens up on the outdoor patio, which I'll go and show you now. So the house is great. I love it. It's just a nice standard three bedroom house, not too big. But this, this is why we bought this place. And this is where the excitement levels really, really uh, start, to, start to lift, you know? So open the slide door. And first of all, you say hi to the beautiful dog, Chippy. Hey boy, you want to say hi to the vlog? Hi vlog. Here. Yeah. So one of our non-negotiables for the house was it had to have a pool because we live on the Gold Coast and you need a pool here. Or if there wasn't a pool, there needed to be a space to put a pool in. So uh, we found a house with a massive yard that we can put a pool in. So this is where it's gonna go. So the pool's going right here in this whole space here. And then we're gonna create a little fire pit area here so some bench seats fire pit pool and then the hangout area over here this is my uh, birthday present six burner barbecue that i got so you can just imagine it you know hanging out here on the outdoor table swimming pool people swimming people in the far end and the fire pit area it's kind of different areas of fun activities you know wow that was bad don't say fun activities again it's so funny when you get in front of the camera, you just do stuff that you normally wouldn't do. It's, uh, it's hard to be yourself, it's hard to be fully yourself when you get in front of the camera. You, you can't help but want to perform, you know? I need to get away from that because I don't want to perform, I just want to be real. Okay, now, what I've really wanted to show you all this time, the backyard. So we've got this retaining wall and then it steps up to this big backyard. And uh, in this corner here, this is where the magic is going to happen. So right here, this is where we're going to build the dream outdoor gym. We're going to throw a concrete slab, probably from uh, around here back, like a 5 by 5 meter, a 25 square meter concrete slab. I'll lift the shed up, put it back on the concrete, and that's where all my equipment will live. That's currently all I own, just a medicine ball, a few plates in the bar, a set of rings that I can't use, a rope that I can't use. So uh, that's all going to change, because on that concrete slab, I'm going to put an outdoor rig, I'm thinking I might even run some artificial turf down the back here so I can do some sled stuff, handstand walks. I might even artificial turf this whole backyard to be honest, just less, less lawn to mow. So if you can imagine that, home gym at the back on the concrete slab, all artificial turf from the concrete to the far end here. And my daughter wants me to build her uh, like a tree house, like a, a house on stilts. So we've got to find some space for that back here as well. And that is the new house team. So uh, right now, I might just grab my skipping rope and bang out some dubbies for Mr. James Newbury. Okay, so I'm still in my slippers. Still sipping my coffee. Haven't done a double under in over two months probably. But we'll give it a crack. Okay, the goal is 200. 200 unbroken. Let's see how we go. Eight. Ten. 20, 40, oh no, I'm going to keep trying until I get to 100 and then if I trip up after 100 I'll stop. Chippy, mate you're going to get hurt. 80, oh. I had the plant on 90. Oops. My wife's gonna kill me. Oh, 90, I had the plant. What a muppet. Okay, give me one second. One more attempt. It's gonna change, change locations. Change, uh, change strategy here. Get a rubber mat out of the shed. Do it back here on the grass. Third and final attempt. Don't know about that. No, no. Ten. Twenty. No. Not today, mate. Not today. Sometimes you just have to know when to hang your rope up and go home. And uh, 
I think I've reached that point for today. Take my 90, I'm broken and run. I was feeling good, bloody plant. Here you are, here you are. Awesome team, that was fun. Good to be back on the vlog and uh, can't see anything, Chip. I can't see the people. I can't see the people. Guys, it's good to be back in the vlog. They'll be coming out very regularly again. I'm gonna take you along the journey of setting up this dream home gym that uh, it's gonna outdo James Newbury's gym. I'll tell you right now. I don't know if you've seen his. If you haven't seen James Newbury's home gym, jump on his Instagram, have a little scroll. Place is pretty amazing. He's got like Under Armour logos and two or three outdoor platforms, like gymnastics, parallel bars, and all the fancy stuff. Nah, but in all seriousness, guys, James is actually creating this group of home gyms that all operate under the Soul 365 name, which is his gym's name. So you can use his programming and kind of um, follow along the scores that everyone's posting from home. So I'm going to uh, affiliate my gym, Gold Coast 365 Home Gym. So, uh, no, not 365. Wow, you're drunk. I'm going to affiliate with it and call my home gym. Uh, Gold Coast Soul 365 so uh, if you're interested in being part of that family of home gyms if you've got a home gym and you want to kind of put it under James's banner then uh, reach out to the man I'm sure he'll be pumped to have you guys stay sexy keep roaring love and again if you like this vlog and you like my content please subscribe I'd really appreciate that and I will see you very soon come on baby you got this 200 easy money Twenty. Thirty. Forty. Fifty. Sixty. Seventy. Rhythm. 